the biomass project emulates economic activities and promotes use of clean energy to reduce greenhouse gas emission from 22% to 24.7%, hence mitigating the impact of climate change. I want to encourage you to continue making sure that we have a self-sustainable industry because that's where we are moving. Congratulations. I've been taken around and I was able to see the products, how they are made, the cleanliness, the hygiene, and all that is quite impressive. The place is clean. Besides representing a substantial and excellent decarbonizing journey, the multi-billion shillings plant aligns with Uganda's National Development Plan and Vision 2040, which prioritizes sustainable development and environmental conservation. As I look at uh, what we've just uh, commissioned today, the, the biomass facility, it's one that, as Diageo, we are really proud of. Because as Diageo, we've been committed to doing business the right way, uh, for many years, before I always say before ESG became uh, uh, fashionable, Diageo was doing what was right for communities and in terms of giving back water and running the businesses in the right way. Today, the launch of this biomass plant, we have come closer to realizing our net zero carbon goal with the plant reducing our carbon emissions by a massive 92%. 8,000 tons of CO2 uh, per year. Honorable Minister, the biomass works to reduce carbon emissions by replacing fuel oil systems we used in the past to produce steam and instead burning organic waste material such as burgers, wood chip and uh, sawdust. The biomass plant is within the organization's promise to accelerate to a low carbon world in which it is committed to only using renewable energy and become a net zero carbon operator by 2030. Especially where you are moving green. There must be a window of incentivizing such industries that are trying to clean off, that are trying to make sure that they reduce the CO2, CO2 emission. We don't only do these beautiful drinks, which uh, are the best in town, but we also are, are the center and the front of innovation. So. The biomass is one of its kind in Uganda, and I think we are probably number three in Africa. Companies with high emissions are urged to make investments of such a scale to reduce carbon emissions in the production processes. Dennis Igor for UBC News, 